This winter has been brutal. It seems like it's never going to end. Well, it reminds a lot of people of the blizzards of 1997. So we decided to take a look back at some of the videos and interviews that some of us will never forget. Some of the images captured in the blizzards of 97 are still frozen in our minds today. Crashes on the interstates piled up faster than the snow. That's if they were open. According to our record books, a blizzard in January saw wind speeds of up to 50 miles an hour with wind chills of 80 below. At Lake Compesca in Watertown, the snowdrifts buried homes around the lake. We had drifts all the way up to our garage and we couldn't um, get anywhere with the car. So it gets pretty bad. The wind is bad and um, really cold. <laughs> I'm ready for spring. The wind was relentless at times, making for poor visibility and treacherous driving conditions day or night. The drifts were taller than most vehicles. And sadly, the snow and cold proved to be too much for farmers and their livestock. A lot of times they just lay down and like they went to sleep. The blizzards of 97 were not fit for man or beast. And then flooding was a big problem on area lakes and rivers that spring, but according to our records, Sioux Falls avoided a potentially devastating flood due to timely cold weather and a gradual snowmelt.